Hi there and welcome to Tassala, a district of Nakonsi Tamarat and located by the sea. Coming from Patalum, we were looking for a place to stay for just one night and we found this small hidden gem, Shansi Resort. So come away with me, nobody has to know where are we gonna go. Mm -hmm. I was just calling to see if you're free. This small resort only has six rooms. We had the one on the top floor with the best view. All rooms come with a terrace or balcony with a small plunge bath. And they all have this amazing sea view. The room itself was very clean and nicely decorated and had a very comfortable bed. Two bottles of water and coffee and tea were complimentary. There was also a variety of snacks and cold drinks in the minibar at a small fee. There was a decent safety box and an umbrella and the beach towels were provided. The cozy bathroom was decorated in a black and white theme, which was very nice. It had a sink, a toilet and a rain shower. Towels, soap and conditioner were provided. As I said earlier, this little hotel is located by the sea and it really feels like you have your own stretch of private beach. It is quite remote, so if you value bars, shops and restaurants close by, then this is not the place for you to stay. They do have their own restaurant and I must say, we had a very tasty meal at very affordable prices that evening. I was looking to belong and I'd already found my home Won't be long, I'm there before the setting sun For you to fall into my arms, the place I call my home I was looking to belong and I'd already found my home I'm 
And this is what happens when you teach your wife how to play pool. Each room has this amazing sea view, which is an absolute treat in the morning when the sun rises. Now I don't mind at all getting up at 6 a.m. to witness this amazing show of nature. There is a small coffee table with two chairs on the terrace, so it was wonderful to wake up with a cup of coffee while the sun slowly prepared itself to shine another day. And when it gets too hot for you during the day, or when you just don't feel like going out to explore the area, you can also take a cool dip in the pool. Here we had to stop for a moment. There are so many palm trees here in the area, resulting in so many coconuts that have to be harvested. And we know, in the West there is a lot of criticism of this method, but here the monkeys are still used to climb into the high trees, loosen the ripe coconuts and throw them down to the ground. Thailand has been raising and training pigtailed macaques to pick coconuts for around 400 years. Farmers in Sri Lanka, Malaysia, India and other countries in the region sometimes rely on monkeys too. A male monkey can collect around 1600 coconuts per day, a female 600. Mm. 
We had a wonderful time at Shansi Beach Resort, mm. but now it's time to resume our travel. See you in the next one.